And introducing our referee on stage, Mr. Narin Hong Hiran. And now, ladies and gentlemen, introducing first, fighting now on the blue corner, 22 years of age. He stands with an hand 75 centimeters tall and weighted with an hand 35 pounds. He will record on 82 wins, 42 losses, and 4 draw. He is former 2 for you champion and former WBC Muay Thai World Champion and former Russian of the Stadium Champion representing Udon Thani Province, Thailand. The two rip for Suming the No Anuak Jam! And his opponent fighting about the red corner, 24 years of age. He stands with an hand 68 centimeters tall and weighing that hand 35 pounds. He already got on 99 wins, 28 losses and 2 draw. He is former WMC World Champion and 2021 Fighter of the Year and RWS 2022 Lightweight World Champion representing Urira Province, Thailand. Let's hear it for Lamna Mulan Tidak Tasko Oh, Antonio! Five months, four fights. It all comes down to this. One of these men will be walking away with three million baht. Five rounds, three minutes. It's Lamna Moonlet taking on Samingek. Lamna Moonlet starts fast. Remember, in the good stages when they fought, Samingek took the opening round. And then he said to, in the video, in the promo, that he went out in the second round too fast, too keen, and Lamna Moonlet was able to counter strike. So it's going to be interesting the way that Samingek approaches this. And you see already he's looking a bit more cautious, taking his time. By the way, Samingek pushing forward making sure he blocks the kicks of Lamna Munlek. As we all know, this will be the weapon of choice. Oh, oh beautiful high kick from Samin Dead. He looks in tremendous shape with Samin Dead, really grown into that frame at 135 now. Yeah, let's not forget five rounds of Muay Thai actions. Open scoring here in RWS, beautiful left kick. Oh, one of the things about Lamna Munlek though, he is a master of fighting off the back foot. In this position right now, he won't care at all. He's completely comfortable with counter striking. And I like what Sunny Dad is doing though. He's not waiting. He is pushing forward. Not wasting any time. Oh! <laughs> well, he ducked under, but I feel he got clipped with an elbow strike. Good start this from both fighters. Sunny Dad especially has to be said. Of course, he's not the favorite for this. But he's still a highly skilled world champion. Coming from Sammy Dead. And you can see both fighters very composed, wow. trading kicks there, and Lamberman left gets the better of it. Crowd are going crazy here tonight. You see that both fighters have brought a lot of fans with them. And this is Muay Thai at its finest, a nice. chess game. Absolutely, good luck you get from Sammy Dead. See Sammy Dead is still stalking. And the Moonlight delivering a left kick and a right. And it's fair to say that Samindar is the one pushing forward. But so far, London and Lek getting the battle out of these exchanges. Oh, yeah, that was a good left kick there from London and Lek. Samindar, every time he moves in with the hands, he gets, he gets kicked, he gets counter struck. Gotta be careful about that. I know he's eager. A chess game of kicks, their footwork, timing, accuracy. The whole package of Muay Thai left kick here again by Lama Munlek and block! Oh, 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 just did. over the top! Wow! Amazing! <laughs> we did not see this every day! Tempted left hand there for Samindet once again. Misses the mark. That was better by Samindet. Surprise hasn't gone back down to the legs. Connected with a beautiful low kick earlier in the round. 10 seconds now to go in round number one, close round. Absolutely great round for both fighters. 
Oh, oh, oh. Slick both the fighters going back to the point of confidence. Yeah, both fighters think they're good enough to take the round. As do both of the fighters' fans going crazy here at RWS in Rajad Amnon Stadium. But of course, he does want to claim the second belt now in the driving seat as we head into round number two. All right, here we go. Second round. Scenario. Yeah. <laughs> Lama Moonlet on the back feet. Something that pushing forward. Lucky not low kick this time. Yeah, I'd like to see something that switching it up with maybe some punches. Switch the timing. Lama Moonlet, an expert as you've mentioned, while I'm fighting on the back foot. Absolutely. Good right kick to the midset from the left there. Oh, 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 As soon as he flips the switch and decides to go aggressive, he looks great. And they do know each other well. They fought in the tournament before, as you've mentioned. Oh, and the left kick. Beautiful exchange, and something they're getting the best out of it. Yeah, something that using those long limbs, or trying to use those long limbs to his advantage. But, you know, Laman is more than capable of fighting. Oh, ho, ho, ho. and tall. again, the Muay Thai, they say it's easy. You can either block it or you kick back. And here, you can see something that are playing that. Samindek going in with that left high kick. Lama Moonlet trying to counter with the left hand. It's a good round, a good opening wrap. So second round, should I say, opening to the round by Samindek so far. Samindek doing much better this round than he was. Again, one and a half minute remaining in the second round. And he's, he's not rushing as well. Yeah, absolutely. He's not panicking. He's still throwing his shots just like that. Oh. Looking very composed. He's not out of this at all. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Both fighters very composed. This is the top level here in that Shenmue Stadium. Oh, and look oh, at this, look one, two. Stunning there from Lamhat Moonlik. Going in with that left midsection kick as well. Something that looks to throw a left hand, but misses. Ooh. Oh, left hand there from Lamhat Moonlik as Something that moves forward. Close fight, close round. Three million baht up for grabs. Oh, oh, oh. Lama gets the best, the better out of this action. Sending there, still very composed, pushing forward. Oh, good kick there. What an exchange! Oh, 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 oh. Lama may just be getting the better of the exchanges here. As we, we've got 45 seconds left on the clock. Right kick there from Sammy Depp. Swing the miss. Oh, oh. left hand by Sammy Depp. Warning shot to Lama Mulek. Chess, a game, a game of timing, a game, a game of precision from those fighters. I'm not sure that will be enough to take the round. But at least Sammy Deck is getting in a few stri strikes there to try and slow down. Oh, look at that. At least give you something to think about. Nine seconds left on the clock. And a lot of people believe that if the fight keeps going at this rhythm, it might be in favor of Lama Moonlight's but he has something they're very confident at the end of the second round. So let's see what, what the judges saw. Yeah, close round, but I, I honestly believe that Lama Moonlight. Lama Moonlight. Well, during the group stages, of course, the final four, this will be the final round. It is not, this is five rounds in the final. Samingek seems really buoyed by the fact that he won that round. Let's see what happens in round number three. All right, here we go. Very important round for both fighters, that's for sure. Double left kick from Alamna Munlek. And again, same scenario. Samingek slowly pushing forward. Both fighters very accurate, as we know. Oh, and the left kick again. Something get caught with a good low kick there. That time blocked. The right kick to the midsection by Lamna Moonlet. And again. And I have to say, this is the third round. The third form. Over hundreds of kicks already. <laughs> Lamna Moonlet almost going high that time. But again, same scenario. Sammy Get is the one who's pushing forward. Lamna Moonlet is the one who's looking to counter strike. Both fighters going good left in kicks to the body. And of course to the legs. 
Proverbial game of chess in full flow right here in the RWS final. Yeah, but I have to say, what an amazing defense from Sunning there tonight. Mm. Slowly pushing forward, not rushing and not falling into any traps. Oh! And here you see timing. Amazing there by Sunning Oh! Oh! oh, oh, oh. One for one! Woo -hoo. You're gonna love this here in RWS. Lamna Munlek so composed, and this is why he was the favorite. But look at something there tonight. Like we said, no pressure at all. Something that was taking it away. Lamna Munlek as he goes into that one. Oh, looking for the left hand, left hit there by Samming Det. And I like what Lamna Munlek is doing. He's not necessarily waiting. Oh, beautiful exchanges there from the former champ. I feel like Lamna Munlek might have got the better of those exchanges, though. Two left hands. This is so close, yeah, so it tense, is. It is. All right, good to the body there by last year's champion. Something that moving forward, looking for that left kick. Oh, right kick to the body. Oh, good change from both fighters. The left kick with the block from Sending there. Oh, and a oh. one-two. Yeah, Lama Mulek now showing a little bit more aggression in round at number three here. Absolutely, and I like the switch with yes. the boxing right now. I'm also interested to know that Sami that is now on the back foot and it's Landa Mulek is the one who's pushing the pace. The right kick, the oh. right hand to the body, oh. by Sami And Sami there more confident than ever as you can hear the crowd going crazy. Now fighting on the back foot. Oh, good right hook there from Landa Mulek. Yeah, but I feel like Sami that this must have been a change when he saw the fact that he won that second round. It was almost like bag of rocks fell off his back, he stood up, he cheered, he applauded, he's looking really fresh here in round number three as well. Oh, beautiful out. action. Just as I say that with 10 seconds left on the court by Lamna Mule. Another very, very close round here at RWS. Yeah, perhaps that last action might have been one that helps Lamna Mule to win the round or not. As Aaron said before, we're not judges. <laughs> so we'll leave it to them. It is interesting how all three judges scored it the exact same way in rounds number one and number two. Number one. Just needs one more round. Unbelievable action here at RWS. Here we go. Fourth round. It might be the round of his life here for both these fighters. In fact, Lamna Moonlight desperately needs to try and even the score. Sanding dead. If he wins this round, then wow. He's almost there. Doesn't he know it? Here we go. Round four. Left high kick. Yep, Lamna Moonlet now being aggressive. And if Lamna Moonlet doesn't win this round, that's going to be trouble. Yeah, Absolutely. Very aggressive right away. Something that more confident, confident than ever. Ooh, and a takedown. Almost. You can, feel, you can feel the tension. You can feel the fact that Lamna Moonlet He's losing as well, and Sammy Dett is fighting with a smile on his face right now. Oh, Lamna Mulek losing his foot in there. And we knew Lamna Mulek was a master at defending and counter attacking, but look at Sammy Dett here. Oh, amazing by Sammy Dett. Beautiful counter strike there. And again. Oh, ho, ho, ho. not as easy as expected, and oh. this is the beauty of RWS. Don't count out Lamna Mulek there as he moves forward, got left hand. Yeah, I feel like the, the range of summing it is just on point here today. Oh, oh, good oh right hand. Good right beautiful hands. From Lamna Mulek. Remember, it's not panic stations just yet. Win the round. Yeah, absolutely oh, beautiful shot here. And you said it. Win the round and go to a judgment round. The fight is not over yet. Not for the champion, not for a man like that, number one leg. Good left knees there, and right's coming in from both fighters. Intensive left hand from Lamna Mule. I'm not sure that snuck through or not. Lamna Mule just edges a little bit closer, looking for that left kick up blocked again by Sammy Dick. Yeah, it's something good. Again, Sammy Dick throws that right kick as Lamna Mule moves forward. Good low kick there. Low kick by Lamna Mule. Midsection kick by Samming Dead. Oh, beautiful. Oh, Such a strike. Throws that left hand. Yeah. And real power, but nowhere near Samming Dead. And the crowd, his fans are enjoying that one. 
Yeah, perfect timing by Saminder tonight. Oh! Oh! What a shot from the champ. I think he just grazed his head with that shot oh! as well. And the Moulet going up high. Oh, good right hook there. Oh, he stumbles. He stumbles. Oh, that's just like the Moulet. Low kicks there from Mamma Moulet. Low kick. Tempted elbow coming in from last year's champ. Wow. That might have turned the tide. He's getting closer and closer this round. Yeah, and this is why this is the final. Ladies and gentlemen, you're witnessing the highest possible level of Muay Thai here. Oh, and a left kick. Takes a left hand from Lam Mamoulet. Oh. to get that from Lam Mamoulet. Surely he's done enough now in this round to take it. Yeah, I've got to agree with you. Even though he's got a small cut, I believe. Sammy Dent still can't win the day. Oh, good spot on the right. Eyebrow is cut. Both sets of fans are cheering. They think their fighter did enough in that round. Wow. Well, I honestly think, I honestly think, even though he did get caught a few times, Lamna Mulek was more aggressive yeah. and connected with more strikes in that round. But the round, you win the fight. You win three million baht. You get to call yourself the RWS champion for 2023. So talk about all or nothing. Talk about pressure. Whew. So intense right now. We will find out who will become the champion of this year. And I was about to say, I wonder how they're going to do it. I wonder if Lamna Mulek is going to push back. I wonder if he's going to continue to push forward. And he is. Lamna Mulek is being the aggressor right now. He paid off in round number four. He's paid off so far in round number five. Lamna Mulek going after him. Kicks to the body here from last year's champion. And again with that beautiful time, left kick. I wonder how Sammy gets his feeling. I wonder if he thought that he won that fourth round. Could this be? This is tense. Stadium feeling quiet right now. Sammy yeah, is trying to stop this onslaught by Lamma Moonlake. Tempted low kick there from Lamma Moonlake. Seems to have fought. Seems to have found, sorry, a sixth gear out of nowhere. There was moments early on in that fourth round where I thought it looked deflated. Not the case. Sammy Dett now on the front foot. I know he could assume that he believes that he's down on the scorecards and Lama Mulek thinks that he's up and that's why we're seeing what we're seeing right now. Sammy Dett pushing forward. Push kick there from Sammy Dett. More left kicks coming in from Lama Mulek. Nice edge sort of stuff here at RWS. Sammy Dett stalking Lama Mulek. Looking for that left hand and finds it. Some great hands thrown in the fourth round and we've seen some good hands being thrown by Lamna Moonlight in round number five as well as Sammy Dett looks for that left high kick. Under 90 seconds left now in this year's competition at Lightweight. Sammy Dett looking for that left kick, unable to find it. You've got to feel that Lamna Moonlight right now is in the driving seat. Sammy Dett pushing forward, good left kick to the body, that will score. Is it enough though, one minute left on the clock, low kick again there by Lamna Moulet. Unable to wobble Sammy Dett, middle left kick, Sammy Dett looking for the left hand, but blocked with that left kick again by Lamna Moulet. Left kick there through the guard by last year's champ. What a fight these fighters have put on, what a tournament, tournament it's been. That high kick for Lamna Mulek. This is looking very, very good for last year's champion. 30 seconds left. Sammy Dett looking for a knee, but blocked again by Lamna Mulek. It's a frustrating round here, in my opinion, for Sammy Dett. Final 15 seconds on the clock. These fighters have fought hard and trained since May this year. This is their fifth fight in as many months. All fighters won, the, won two rounds in the first four. Coming down to the fifth and final round. An unbelievable performance there for both fighters. I've got to say, Lamna Moonlight there is looking a lot more confident going back to his corner than Sammy Dett is going back to his. 
feel they think that he's done enough to take it away from Samingdet, a very valiant Samingdet, whatever happens here tonight. He has staked his claim as one of the best at 135 pounds, no doubt about it. All right, well, there has to be a winner due to the fact that it was drawn after four rounds. What a fight. Let's have a look at the highlights from the fight. They have beautiful left kicks from Sami, sorry, from Lam Namule. Losing my voice, I've got two final fights to go here. Lam Namule twisting Sami Dek up earlier in that fight. But of course, Sami Dek fought back. And it was up by two rounds to one going into that fourth round. What an amazing fight. The atmosphere here at Rajalam Nun. Adding to the occasion as well. But Lam Nam Mulek, I believe he did enough in round number five to take it. Lam off. I've been wrong before. I'm sure you're well aware of that fans watching around the world on the zone in 200 plus countries and territories. Beautiful right hook there from Sammy Dead. But is it to be in vain? All right, here we go. The official confirmation. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome on stage the manager of the National Sports Development Fund, Dr. Suprani Kuptasa. And right here with us on the stage with the RWS Champions Belt, Mr. Bang Tian Chai, PC Putinan, President of RWS and Board Director of President Man Stadium. And now, ladies and gentlemen, of the five rounds of Muay Thai action, we go to the judges' scorecard! All three judges scored his vote 48 to 47. We have a winner by way of unanimous decision! And the US 2023 Life and Champion of the World! For the winner! What? Hey! I'm going to Oh, Congratulations to RWS 2022 and 2023 Lightweight World Champion! Love the moonlight! Tina Dosko! <laughs>